Hello and welcome back to another MATLAB video. Today we're going to be talking about Live Editor controls. These controls allow you to interact with your own live script easily, as well as share your script with the confidence that others will interact with it in the way that you want them to. There are five different interactive controls you can use in a MATLAB Live Editor script. There is the slider, allowing the user to change a value between a set, min, and max, the drop-down menu, with which the user can change the value of a variable by choosing from a list of values, the checkbox, where the user can set a variable's value to the logical true or false, the edit field, in which the user can type in and set the value of a variable, and the button, that the user can use to run code or code sections with just a click. For today's example, the van der Waals equation of state for gases, the only controls we will use are the drop-down menu, the slider, and the edit field. In the equation PV equals NRT, the drop-down menu controls the elemental type of gas using the equation, the slider controls the temperature, and the edit field controls the pressure level of said gas. All these work just the same as regular variables when it comes to how the code runs, since as you can see, the output of plot changes interactively with the changing controls. To add or change the labels or other settings on any of the above controls, simply double-click on the control to open up its settings menu, and then edit it to your liking. Labeling controls clearly and concisely is important because of another live editor control functionality, hiding code. Sometimes when you share code with others, you don't want them to open and scroll through every last line of code you wrote. You might not want to overwhelm them, or maybe you just want to keep some of the details to yourself. To hide your code in your live script, click the lowest of these three buttons over here. Now, your actual code is hidden from view, and only your outputs are visible. Importantly, any controls you have put into your code remain visible, allowing the user to still interact with your code. For more practice with Live Editor controls, consult the Help menu to find downloadable examples using these same controls in Live Scripts. Now that we have a deeper understanding of MATLAB's Live Editor controls, you can more effectively share your code with others, and they can more easily see and understand exactly what you want them to. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you guys in another video.